So guys, I wanted to welcome you to... I don't know, maybe the start of a couple different type of E3 videos. So I've been watching the press conferences and I was going to upload videos on things that I saw that really stood out to me. And nothing's really been popping. Uh, I think Battlefield 5 looked pretty cool. I think I'm getting gameplay for that. Uh, Xbox conference, I just got done watching that. And the one thing that really stood out to me was I didn't know. I thought it would be saved for the Ubisoft conference, but the Division 2 got announced. They had a trailer, which shows us in Washington, D.C., which is awesome. So I'm going to show that. And then I'm going to show the gameplay that they had and just kind of talk over it. So, I love you guys. If you're excited for this game, if you're excited for any of the games coming out this E3, just let me know which ones you'd like me to cover. And, uh, yeah. Let's do this, guys. Washington, D.C. The most heavily protected city on Earth. Within its limits, 177 foreign embassies, 550 elected officials, and 23,000 military personnel. In the event of an attack, critical personnel are evacuated. Underground shelters open, while complex defense systems patrol the sky. But nothing stopped the virus. 27 days after patient zero, Washington fell. It began with riots on K Street, then shootings in the National Mall. Troops withdrew to bunkers. Civilians were left in the streets. America is on the brink of collapse. But some people have survived. Gardens grow on rooftops, their fences patrolled with rifles, in communities that live under constant siege. Survival has taken the form of urban warfare. Centuries ago, on this very soil, brother fought brother, spilling blood to forge the United States. History is threatening to repeat itself. Now, in the heat of summer, Six months after the outbreak began, a remnant of a corrupt state lurks in the shadows, ready to engage in a new civil war. Agents of the Division are the only ones standing against it. But how do you save a nation when its enemies come from within? Alright guys, so I was told that I haven't watched this yet. It does say M-game footage and everything. Apparently they have their own commentary that they put on this. Uh, I don't know if I'll get it without it down the road, but I wanted to kind of take the initiative and give you my early thoughts on what I see. I'm, a, I'm such a huge fan of The Division, and I really want to see this game succeed. Uh, so I was surprised we got this at the Xbox conference and not the Ubisoft one. I'm sure we'll get more. Massive Entertainment, same studio as before. Alright, so there's only... Interesting. So there's there's four people playing right now, Dude, so I'm guessing the party hear, size is still four. Yeah. Closer this time. The setting for this feels like Wildlands almost. I thought it took place. So apparently Washington DC is where it takes place. I thought that like the game came out in March and I had a feeling it would come out early 2019. I just didn't know when. It was so it was cutting it close. That last quarter, you know? Or that last bit of quarter one. All right, the noise for the loot was really nice. I think uh, loot loot games just in general pull me in. Military Do shotgun. You guys have or what? Yeah. One thing I hope that doesn't happen. I hope that this game. I don't. I mean, I'm sure it's being played on an Xbox One X right, or a PC at this point, since it is the uh, Xbox conference. But uh, my guess would be a PC. So Black Friday. This takes place. What they say, like six months after the virus broke out. The setting looks really nice. Check out this little area. Hey, let me just talk to this guy. So is this like a... It feels more of an open world type... ...setting. I got this guy. Discovered side man. Oh, so this is just like the piers and stuff in the first game. Alright, so it looks like it plays the same as well. Ooh. Oh, there's the, uh... Okay. Capitol Hill. Capital. All right. You should have a new side mission on the map. Yeah, we're not that far. Okay, do it after the crash site. Well, it's just yeah. like an enhanced version of the first game. Uh, everything just seems like an upgrade, which is exactly what I wanted. I didn't want the game to change too much. 
Because the way the game played was hey, phenomenal, I, I thought. You get the emote will back. Kit, we gotta get you leveled up. I know. Please help. I've been busy. Level 29 is not much different from 30, unless 30 is where you can unlock the end game and then you get gear score, I'm guessing. <laughs> I don't know. So I will have some cool stuff tomorrow during the uh, Ubisoft conference. I can't tell you guys what it is, but I got to play something early and it was very exciting. Let me adjust my build. Got my crossbow and chem launcher. Character. Oh, check this out. Oh, lightweight M4. That's what you want to put on. Why does he want to put on the shotgun? Elite enemies. Chem cloud out. Matt, can you flank them and get a clear shot? I'll take that sniper on top. Wait for it. Got her. I've never played the division. Usually the guys I play with, it's like we just go in guns blazing. Because it's not really, I mean, it is a cover based shooter, but Matt, the game's out. never been played like that. Right, Especially against red enemies. More bad guys on the other side of the plane. Grenade, grenade. I wonder how the enemy AI is going to be, because he's kind of focused on one of them. I'm guessing his weak point is the backpack. Matt, I need your help. If I was him, I would shoot Over it, here. but. That's what it feels like when you guys watch me play a game. I'm watching somebody else play. Oh, that is sick. Whoa! Oh, I'm stuck. Do you a little help? What is that? What? What is that on the feet right there? Thanks, Matt. Your teammates are the only ones that can oh, get there's that. there's a dude rushing through the plane. That's gonna be a problem, especially in the dark zone. Guys. Yeah, I'll see Get hit with some of that emergency glue or whatever that was. <laughs> Just over here, taking it all in. Is that a crossbow? Yeah, hang on, I'll get you. Oh my goodness! Come on, come on. Yo, they got crossbows in this game. When did that happen? Get that see this point. guy? He's an elite enemy because he's yellow. Oh, yeah, she was backpack. That armor Setting looks sick, though. Thank you for the revival. So I see the skill tree. It looks like he has seeker mines. Is that what that is on the right one? He's not using his skills though. Map with the hive knife. I just lay it on. Could be something else. Again? Drop down. Now there goes his armor. That swing. Oh yeah. All right. You're on your own. You go. I think I'm more interested to see. Oh, that's some high end loot right there. Alright, flare is up. Control point is ours. Nice. Guys, wanna check out the plane? Let's go. I wonder if it's because right now it looks Analyzing like it's more of an open world, not like just building after building. I wonder how it's gonna play. Like, it looks like it's just as smooth as uh, the first game was. Maybe a lot smoother, obviously. Jesus! Whoa, that's nuts. I knew that was gonna happen. Let's check it out. <laughs> Great idea. Let's just die. Uh oh, that epic music. So, game plan. Take Where are they going? Back. Going I to the capital, I'm guessing. Three, two, one, go, 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 go. Wait, there's, there's never that much coordination in this game. That is pretty awesome, though. All right, well, first look at it. March fifteenth. Oh, that's gonna be fun. All right, well, I love you guys. I think, uh, did it just, hold on, did it just say open registration? Oh, Alright guys, that's pretty much it Setting on the Division up. 2, unless they have more Thank tomorrow at the me. Ubisoft conference. Um, that's probably I'm going to cover for that. So, love you all. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoy this stuff, just be sure to drop a like, and I will definitely, guess I'll cover more stuff as it pops up. If anything catches my eye, even if I miss it, I'll definitely probably cover it throughout the week. And I'll uh, just kind of look out for the comments, so. I love you guys. Take it easy. Keep going. Good job.